right here who this all right y'all so this is what it is giving and i must say she feeling it i have to get used to it not being as big and bodacious as i like but i can i can work this i can work this Mhm. Mm it felt really good to have someone else in my hair i sat down in her chair at 9 30. i'm actually back in my driveway at home and it's 11 58. i'm here for some quality service she she my kind of people so thank you miss felicia i love it now let's get in these youtube streets first stop hobby lobby
how we up, but you stay down. Real nigga from the ad, about to pay out. Spending time wind down, what is take out? And when I'm in them walls, you feel it in your bones. I've been on the road, this choke that I hold on your soul got me making up for days out. Got you singing tones till you laid out. It feel like what we are never fade out. Fade out, fade out. I let it ride when I usually would have rolled out. Baby, say please and thank you, cause your love will stay down. Appreciation, cause your love will stay. You know, I ain't pressed for fame. Niggas club chasing they all lanes. Trust me when I say I'm still the same. They gon' understand it one day. Yeah, yeah. Told him that I gave him life. He said, Right. Now we can leave from my side. Oh my God. Hey, you know, I ain't chasing fame. You caught the vibe that I'm sending you away. You see that I'm still the same. Real one, I'ma never change my way. I'm hitting it right and treating you right You never leave in my side, you in for the right Only for love, why your exes can't get enough Man. They trying in line, they down on their luck Keep them guessing when they ask about us Don't pay them no mind, that's how we stay up Niggas DM, don't know where to leave it I post a pic, they comments be tweaking Usually won't, but sometimes I read them Leave them on red, I swear I can't please them oh. But when it comes to you I know how to handle that, boss Even stay faithful while you was doing me wrong I let it ride when I usually would've rolled out Baby say please and thank you cause your love will stay down in the past, that's all done now. So put that on me for my baby, cause I always say, You know, down. I ain't pressed for fame. Niggas cloud chasing they all lanes. Trust me when I say I'm still the same. They gon' understand it one day. Yeah, yeah. Told him that I gave him life. He said, Right. Now we can leave from my side. Oh my god. Hey, you know, I ain't chasing fame. You caught the vibe that I'm sending you away. You see that I'm still the same. Real one, I'ma never change my way. As long as I'm hitting it right and treating you right. You never leave it my side, you in for the right.
pray uh-huh. But even on the bad days I thank God for making me Royals to another shopping haul and I know I know I know I said it was one and done but guess what guess what you're gonna do you're gonna enjoy this haul and you're gonna mind your business okay so grab go ahead and grab yourself a little a little something, something to sip on it's not a lot guys I promise it's not a lot I'm gonna take you guys or I may have already taken you guys through Hobby Lobby to show you some of the goodness that they have both fall and Christmas because I do have Christmas on the brain, but I'm gonna get into the items that I have for indoor, outdoor, clients, and everything in between. So we have been to the Dollar Tree, Michaels, Southern Home Decor, Hobby Lobby, and who would I be if I didn't give you a little some sum from Amazon, AKA Amazon. So without any further ado, guys, we're gonna hop right in. I'm gonna start right here with uh, who is this? This is the Dollar Tree, you guys. I think I kind of sort of scored at the Dollar Tree. Although, both items that I'm about to share with you, I said I was not going to get. However, this is an exception to the rule. And it is none other than this cuteness, you guys. Look at these. Now, if you have watched my last vlog, then you've already seen these. But I wanted to just give you guys a formal, just a whole little spot. I wanted to give them a whole little spotlight in a actual sit down haul now listen this is not a typical razzle dazzle beat my face kind of haul this is a girl get this haul done so you can get these projects done type of haul because literally after i finish this haul guys i'm going right into styling aka the room i'm in so you're going to see this video up next but let me get back to the haul of it all how cute are these guys it is um a pumpkin pick and i think it was geared towards the halloween season but you guys know she ain't about that life. So I thought they would be perfect for my outdoor styling and the black and white theme. And it is not a pinstripe, it's more like a swirl type of pattern on here. And they had some that was just like a, you know, a traditional pinstripe, but I thought these would just be so cute and whimsical to tie in with my whole pumpkin, um, whimsical fall theme outside. And I went ahead and picked up, now the other day, I was the one store they only had the three. And then today we were out and I saw these five at another um, Dollar Tree. So I went ahead and grabbed all of them. So now I have eight of them for my um, pumpkins, for my, what am I doing? Swags. I'm gonna do a swag on the front and a traditional wreath on the back. So I've got enough to cover that. Okay, I'm gonna toss them there. And guys, this right here, she was just sitting ready, waiting on me. You guys know that I am taking Emmy, AKA Emma Green into my primary bedroom this year for fall and when I saw this I thought she has to come home with mama how gorgeous is this you guys it is a true emerald green with the gold little stem and it was only five dollars at the Dollar Tree so I felt like these items were definitely worth making an exception to my no more pumpkin type of ruling okay so I got those from the Dollar Tree okay so up next guys I'm trying to go from least to greatest so then the next spot I went to that I didn't get a whole whole lot from would be Michaels. Ouch. Just stuck myself. Now this is, y'all, this haul is literally all over the place. Literally all over the place. So I'm going to pick up everything that I picked up from Michaels just to share with you real quickly. Now Michaels has their fall picks 50% off and I just could not resist. So the first thing I got was these beautiful, pretty orange or burnt orange. They're kind of a mix of a bright orange and a burnt orange. They have a variation of colors on the stem which is why I like them so they were they're called that's a stem what is it t-i-g-e not sure what that particular plant is called but it gives it gives pompous grass it gives fern somewhat but I am liking the texture of it all so I just picked up two picks again this is just going to be um style for my outdoor and front and back door wreaths and I'm going to give you a little designer tip when you're making wreaths, if you make, even if you're making centerpieces, even though this is one stem, you technically can make one, two, three, four, 
five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten smaller picks, actually 11 smaller picks out of this one branch. So if I dismantle this particular pick, I can get 11 of these, 11 of these stems out of this one particular pick, which is why I chose it because it gives me a lot of volume. It's pretty by itself in a garland or swag, but I want to dismantle it and give it more of a wow factor. So I got two of those. They were, again, I'm sorry, I'm gonna tell you about the price. $9.99 at 50% off. So I've got two of those in that color. And then I went ahead and picked up two of them. Now this is shedding and it is sticking, girl. I'm like, what is this sticking me? So it is shedding quite a bit, but they're gonna be side by side. But another trick, even to that, is to get you some hairspray or just some of your clear acrylics paint or clear or coat paint, coating paint, and it'll stop the shedding of any, even your pompous grass. So again, same concept with this one, but these are gonna be for my indoor styling. So I got them in this pretty wheat color. Love, love, love those. Okay. And so then to tie back in with my orange, black, and white, my whimsical fall look, I picked up these cute little picks. I only got three because again, I can separate or dismantle them and I can get three, six, nine pieces out of these three stems. So that is a good way to stretch your dollar when styling. And it gives you more creative control in that you can place those picks exactly where you want them in your designs, okay? So now we're moving over to where we're going next. We're gonna go to Southern Home Decor. So first things first, you guys, I picked up a wreath um, form for a sports stand wreath that I'm doing a house divided look. And I got this for that, okay? And so keeping in with that whole little theme of it, I'm gonna toss that. Those were $7.99. Again, I have that store linked in my previous video, which was the home up there I'll link the video and in that video I have this particular store link because they did show me that they are now able to, to ship or will be shipping so I'm gonna let me set these down so I can get, show you guys what I'm supposed to be showing you so for that whole house divided sports theme it is going to be um, Denver Broncos and Dallas Cowboys so I picked up some ribbon to tie in with that look so you guys know that Denver Broncos are the um, navy blue and orange and then cowboys are navy white and silver so i got that i got a orange and white just to tie in with this look i love to create a little bit of dimension and all of these guys with the seven this one was 7.99 6.99 and 6.99 and i love this craft store because they you're going to get a 10 foot roll of ribbon where it's like in your local store is michael's hobby lobby you may not get as much on your spool but you still can get them at 40% off. However, these are going to give you those one-of-a-kind um, picks or floral stems or ribbons that you want for custom looks. And this one says touchdown, field goal, go team, safety, tackle. So it definitely ties in. It has footballs on there. So it definitely ties in with the whole football theme. And so I got that and that to coordinate with that. Okay. And so for the Dallas Cowboys, I also picked up another roll of a blue and white polka dot and it's $7.99. So just to kind of see how one side will be styled here, one side will be styled there. I'm gonna set that there, give myself some room. Okay, and so keep it in again with that whole look, guys. I picked up just a football strip and it's like a one and a half inch ribbon. I always like to do a different size or variation of sizes. And then I picked up a solid orange to kind of tie in with that. I have some more items to share with you from Amazon that will really bring this whole little situation together. So I have that, okay? Also from Southern Home Decor, I picked up some items for moi. You guys know that I'm doing that whimsical look outside in orange, black, and white. And so I picked up this black and white Harlequin print. It was $8.99. But my thinking was also that I'm not gonna use all of this on this on this wreath, so how cute is that? I love it when I can purchase items and get multi-uses out of that. So that is a whole nother, a whole nother style right there. So all of these, you guys, again, were all under $7.99. Well, this one was $9.99, but I feel like it's so worth it. Two and a half inches, two and a half inches, and then this one is a one and a half inch. So we got that, okay? Moving right along, moving right along. Now to these gorgeous picks, you guys. Now I did pick up some Christmas things, but I'm gonna save those items for an actual Christmas haul because your girl is already ready for Christmas. But I picked up these cute little picks, you guys. Yes, they are Christmas picks, but they're gonna tie in beautifully with the whole whimsical fall look that I'm going for out on the 
front and back door area. So how cute is that? So I picked up two of these and they have one, two, they have six um, little balls per pick and I picked up two of them. I thought I picked up three. I picked up two of these and they were $7.99, okay? And then I'm gonna toss that over there and then I picked up two of these. Now, right now, this, I love the whimsical vibe of this, but again, this is something that I can take, dismantle. And right now, these look like candy canes, but it is flexible and I can totally change the shape of this. I can even make it go straight. I can make it be wavy if I want, or I'm gonna make it like a curly cue, but how cute is that? So again, that ties into that whole whimsical look, changing the shape from a candy cane, which is more Christmas style, to just something whimsical and fun. So I got two of those and they were also $7.99, okay? Oh, I did get three, okay, here's the third one. You guys know how I am about odd numbers, so I got three of those, all right? And so, then that takes me to my next location, which will be Hobby Lobby. All right, guys, so now from Hobby Lobby, I picked up more ribbon, are you surprised? The ribbon is 40% off this weekend, so I picked up some blue and white to tie in with the Cowboys look. I picked up some more orange and white that could tie in with the, um, with the, who is this, Broncos, and also could tie in with my whimsical fall look. And so I picked up for the whimsical fall is um, a black and white. I love that it's solid black here, and then it's got the white stripes. So again, I'm going to be playing on total pattern. And then I have some items coming from another craft outlet store, but I'm probably just going to share that, show that once I get the wreaths made because I don't want to do another haul y'all I want to get these completed and done so we can get into this home update with the finished and painting you know y'all know if you've been a part of the royal family you know that there's a lot going on in the royal house baby we're decorating we're updating we're styling events we're doing all of the things along with styling hair so I'm trying to get it all done as quickly and expeditiously as possible so there is the ribbon for the wreaths and the orders of it all okay and so also from Hobby Lobby Okay, oh, here's another ribbon, Lord. Another orange and white, again, that will tie in with both looks, both Broncos and my Whimsical Fall. But I picked up some crafting paint, you guys, because I told you in the previous shopping haul that I was going to be painting those metal pieces that I picked up from Hobby Lobby. And I'm gonna give them just some cute little design patterns, polka dot, pinstripe, harlequin looks with these three colors and variations of styles and um, sizes. So I picked up, um, one of, he's only got a small one of the orange because I'll be predominantly using a black and white and this will be the accent. So this one was $1.99 for eight full ounces and this is the Crafters brand. And then I picked up two 16 ounces for $3.99, one in white and one in black, okay? I'm trying to move this white on along, you guys. And then I got from the Hobby Lobby. Now, again, I love to tell you guys or encourage you guys to not always look at items for what they are intended for. Meaning, if an item is a Christmas item or a Valentine's item or Easter item, think of ways that you can use it in your home or in your space anytime you want. Not just for a holiday, but if it's a yearly color for you, then you can use that item all year long because it'll coordinate with your looks. And with that being said, you guys, I was in the Christmas section and I picked up these picks. They're pretty, those whimsical blacks, so black is your color this year for Christmas. Go ahead and get these, they're 50% off. But because I'm doing that whimsical fall, I am, um, I picked these up for that. And they're also gonna go with one of my Christmas looks for this year. So I picked those, I picked up 10 of these. They're $2.99 at 50% off. Christmas is 50% off. This is, yeah, I picked up 10 of those for, um, again, it's gonna be dual function. It'll serve for fall. And it'll also serve for my holiday style, for one of the spaces for holiday style. And I always pick up these, you guys, these glittered ferns. They have them in white. I think I saw them in red, I'm not sure, don't quote me, but I also see, always see them in silver, golds, and champagnes. But I wanna believe they brought the reds back this year. Y'all, as you seen from the hall, from the, from the walkthrough, Hobby Lobby is showing out this year with the, with the Christmas. I mean, they're bringing it, they are bringing it. But again, this is not just Christmas, this is actually, Fall and early Christmas is what I'm gonna call it. So I picked up more of these picks, $2.99. And these are gonna, again, be for my sports theme, my house divided, and it's going to be for my outdoor looks as well. So $2.99 and I got 10 of those, okay? And also from Hobby to Lobby, I picked these up. I told you guys when I did my fireplace update or makeover, 
that I was going to do something different in the fireplace insert, guys. And so I was playing around with it, trying to see what I wanted to do. But I'm going to share with you what I actually decided to go with. And this will tie in with it. I told you guys I'll be collecting a variation of candles to put in that space because I wanted to just pack it out with some beautiful white candles. And Hobby Lobby had these gorgeous babies for 40% um, off there, $17.99. And I picked up, went ahead and picked up two. And then I just, I'm going to gradually just be collecting variation of heights inside. And I'm going to go to the at home store because I know they have a good collection of white candles as well. But just picking up a collective uh, curated look for that um, particular project. Not rushing, it's when I see something I like. I'll just add to it, but I'm going to show show you what the foundation of that look is going to be here shortly. Okay, also from Hobbies Lobbies, I picked up these, you guys, these beautiful cream color, uh, like a, I don't know if this is velvet or Chanel, pumpkins, they were $1.99 and 40% off. I picked up five of those. How darling are they? I've already got Autumn 24 on the brain side. These are going to be perfect this year and next year, okay? Uh, now, for these items, guys, I simply underestimated <laughs> the girth and width of my um, former dining room table. I had everything in mind that I wanted to do, and I'm still doing that look. But once laying everything out, kind of sizing it up, I realized I'm going to need a little bit more. So what I did was just went back and re-up on things that I already have. I'm just adding to that look. So technically, I'm not creating a new look. I'm just building on a look that's already that I've already had with things I've already purchased from Hobby Lobby. So thankfully they repeat a lot of their items so I was able to get everything I needed. And so this was one of the, these were some of those things. And they are these cute little mini um, wheat picks. This is, I don't think this is necessarily pompous grass, but I absolutely, absolutely love these. I love the texture of them and they scream fall to me. I have five of them already. I just wanted to add five more to kind of create a little fuller, little um, bouquet for an area, okay? And, okay, let me show you this one next. Is that, oh, where is this from? This is, from, I think this is from Michaels. I don't think I got this one Hobby Lobby, but I picked up just some brass, uh, which, what is this one called? Brass metallic gold spray paint for some more projects around the house, and you'll see that in upcoming videos. Oh, I'm sitting here missing out on the whole entire situation. Well, let me share this first. Let me share this, honey. I was in there just buying up some stuff, but not all of this for me. So this, you guys, is for me, and I absolutely love it. I have been looking for something to build on to create a, an elongated um, centerpiece on my dining room table, and I was almost went with like some some garland that I some Christmas garland, but I would have to pack out ribbon and just other things like that, and I didn't want to do any of that. I wanted to just keep it strictly fall picks for that um, particular look that I have in my head. And when I saw this, I thought perfect because I actually had went over to the stem area of the fall section and picked out smaller picks. And lo and behold, I saw this and it has all of the picks that I had picked out to create said foundation. But the bonus is that it has candle holders that I'm going to place. You just have to come back and watch and see what, it, what I do with it. But this is absolutely gorgeous, you guys. It's pretty by itself, but you guys know that I'm going to take it to that royal glam level and give it a little bit of razzle-dazzle for my dining area. So I'm going to essentially elongate this piece by two, maybe two feet here and two feet there. But this will be the foundation for that. And I love that it has a grapevine base so that I can build and add stems into it as I desire. But this will be the foundation of that. And this is $49.99 at 40% um, off. But I absolutely love the chocolates and cognacs and creams. Oh my. And it even has some cute little acorns tucked inside. So I thought this was just absolutely perfect for um, acorns and pine cones actually tucked inside. I thought you're getting a lot for a big bang for your book. And even though, you know, for this piece that's already assembled, you just simply add to the look to create that one of a kind look that you want for your space. And so that is what I'm going to be doing. And I'm going to be doing so by using picks that I already had. All I, like I said, I just needed to add to them. And guys, I absolutely love these picks. I have two of them from previous years. I think I've had them like a couple of years now. And I was so glad to see that they brought them back this year because again, I needed more of them just to create a little bit more um, girth and dimension to my dining area. So this is going to create a beautiful fall um, garland, if you will, down my dining room table. So just imagine 
this kind of so you guys can see where I'm going with this. You see how that, you see how I just elongated this piece with these pieces? Absolutely gorgeous. I played around with it in the store because I knew, I had been playing around with it on my dining room table already. So I knew what I was looking for. And when I saw this, I thought, well, this would be even per more perfect. It'll be easier to assemble, less work, but it definitely ties in with the color scheme of that whole Tennessee whiskey look and feel. So I got two more of these. It's beautiful, beautiful picks, you guys. I love these. Now they did, of course, go up this year. Like last year, I think they were... Well, the year I got them, they may have been like $12.99 and half off, but this year they're $18.99 and $40 off, but I needed them. And it's something that I'm going to love forever because it's a quintessential fall color that I love, okay? And so also building on what I already had, I have some of these in my um, collection already. I just, again, needed to add more to complete the look in this new space that I have. So they're $7.99 and they were 40% off and I just picked up four more because I have I think four or six already. So just build it on what I already have, you guys, okay? Finishing up from Hobby Lobby, guys, I have been solicited to create um, florals for a pastor's, um, I think it's a pastor's appreciation, a pastor's anniversary, church anniversary or something. But I've been solicited to create um, centerpieces or a centerpiece to sit like center stage in their sanctuary, like in front of the, the pulpit. So this is something that, fun fact, the first craft project I ever did in my life was a centerpiece for our church. So whenever I'm asked to do these, it just kind of brings back that, you know, that's where I got that creative. That's where I started with the floor design. It was the first floor thing that I ever like technically did professionally. And I was so proud of it. <laughs> I wish I had a picture y'all, it was so pitiful, but I was so proud of that little centerpiece. And the church loved it at the time. Like this was nearly, my baby was probably, three or four at the time and she's 30 so that tells you how long ago it was but I was so proud of myself so I picked up these picks you guys I just love them I think these are magnolia leaves I'm almost certain these are magnolia leaves I just think it's classic and it's something that and they want something that can sit on their um on their pulpit year round to tie in with their colors and so then I also picked up just something to kind of fill it out you also want some nice whimsical greenery so I got that okay and so their colors are blue and gold. So when I saw this, I thought, how perfect would that be? And I'm just literally just gonna create just a mock look for you guys with this for your benefit and for mine. <laughs> so and then I'll just set that down in there, but I love, I love, love, love where that is going already. But how pretty is that? Can y'all see that? And then we just pop a little bit of the blues in here. Now, I know a lot of creators um, encourage or influence and say, don't ever cut your stems. But I, I beg to differ in certain circumstances. Like for me, when I'm creating something custom for a client, I'm gonna cut the stems because I'm not gonna be reusing it. I'm making it custom for their desired look. So cut away, you know? So this is kind of where it's gonna be going. And then that'll be kind of like in the top. I don't know how this is looking, y'all, but in my mind, this is this is the Bijon. But it'll be nice, bit bigger and fuller, of course. It'll be all spread out with greenery and all that good stuff. But that's kind of the vibe. And so that's their church colors. It's the blue and gold. And so that's going to sit um, center stage up there. And I done put them all up. I ain't told y'all how much nothing costs. But all of the bushes were on sale. They were 40% off. A mess. I know that the big gold one was $29.99 at 40% off. So let me just dismantle and tell y'all what it was, okay? So the, the gold one was $29.99 at 40% off. The, let's see, this one here. This one was $15.99 at 40% um, off. And then the magnolia leaves were, where are y'all? Yeah, okay, so the magnolia leaves were $21.99 at 40% off. And I picked up a couple of, yeah, I picked up two of those. I just think they're so, so pretty. I love that. Love, love, love that. And then I picked up just this blue, and it was um, $19.99 at 40% um, off. So I got that. And I think that was all from Hobby Lobby. All right, guys. All right, guys, so the last and final stop, Amazon, a.k.a. Amazon. All right, guys, so I've been telling you guys about this whole 
house divided. And let me know in the comments, are you guys a house divided? Does your hubby have a team and you have a team? Or is it the son, the husband and the sons with different teams? But let me know. I want to know how popular the house divided look is in your area. Because it's really a popular thing and, um, around here. There's a lot of house divided looks. I'm trying to stack this up so you guys can get the visual of what is about to take place with these reefs. Okay, so that's not there. So I'm going to set that there. And that's maybe. So... Even with the, okay, nope, so I need another one to tie in to match. Okay, so then you have that. And so then, guys, from from Amazon, now I will say this. They got me on this because I thought this was at least <laughs> a couple of yards of fabric, but I picked up a Denver Broncos ribbon. And this is, y'all, this is what it, this, this for $7.99. So I, I just assumed that it was a roll of ribbon. I don't, I don't know. Anywho, I can get at least three strips out of it so three strips for that side and then i picked up a dallas cowboys at 7.99 but you see what this is this is maybe a two foot i think it was a 28 inch when i went back and read the description like oh yeah y'all got me but in the picture it is an actual roll of ribbon so i assumed i was getting a whole roll of ribbon but they got me they got me they got me so that is going to be the look so the house divided Denver Broncos and the Dallas Cowboys. So I like to give the same amount of ribbon for each look. And I told you guys that I have some other things coming. We'll get into, well actually, there is a store, like when I was heavy, heavy into the wreath making, y'all, there was a time when I was making, I was pumping out 10, 15 wreath orders weekly. Like I was heavily into the wreath making, especially during the Christmas season. And I used to order from this site called Crafters Outlet. I think that's the name of it. I'll link it in my description box. And so when I got quite a bit of, a bit of orders this year, I said, let me go back and revisit that and see if it's more con more feasible or more convenient. Just because I started picking up from my local craft store once I was just doing smaller amounts of orders. But since I have quite a bit coming up for this year, I went ahead and ordered from them. And guys, they have an amazing selection to choose from. And so I'll share with you guys um just as i'm talking now i just pop up some pictures of the things that i've ordered and when you see them in said reefs or even my reefs then you'll know i picked up deco mesh to go with these pieces i picked up um some ribbon that's going to tie my whole fall whimsical fall look together outside just a, a whole lot of things and they have really really cute christmas decor as well so i'll link their website in my description box so that if you want to you can certainly shop there and i will also link southern home decor and then everything else that i can link i will link it for you guys but back to amazon you guys know that i do a lot of the things okay so in event planning world i have the cutest little first birthday party theme coming up and it is a cookie monster theme and so the colors are uh, royal blue black and white and we're going to emphasize that with a pinstripe or whatever so i picked up um this for make some cute little treat boxes and i thought this was a little bigger too but we're going to work with it so I picked up the little blue trinket boxes and also to go on, I picked up these cute little googly eyes for the Cookie Monster eyes and we're gonna make little custom boxes for all of the little kiddos for the party. I thought that was super cute. And I wanna say this is maybe like seven or nine ninety nine for 20 of them, I believe. Party treat box, decorative. It does not say how many on here, but I think it was like 20 of them. Super cute, you guys. And then I just ordered these, I think it was like $5.99 for this entire box. It does not say what the count is on here, but I'll leave again. I'll link all of those in my description box because they had other colors as well. And so, also to tie in for that whole Cookie Monster theme, I picked up a couple of sets of balloon um, kits, and it's just easier for me to buy the balloon kits like that, guys, just because I don't have the space. Or up until recently, I didn't have a lot of design of balloon designs that I was you know solicited to do. But lately, that's picked up, so I may start ordering them in bulk by color but right now i just ordered the kits from amazon and i may just get a couple of them and it has been working for me so far so that is what i do okay and so i got told you guys that i was working on something for um for the fireplace look and guys it is i picked up these and they are some crisp oh this is heavy it's a 10 pound bag of um fire glass you typically use it for like a fire pit but I envision having this laid out in the base of my fireplace insert and then placing all those beautiful candles on top. And I can just see them like hitting the remote control and just a little flickering flames just giving me that whole um, 
fireplace vibe for the fall and winter. So I picked up one 10 pound bag and if it's not enough, then I'll just order another one. But again, I will have it linked in my description box for you guys. Okay. Oh, this sucker is heavy. Okay. And then the final thing that I got you guys is for my dining area. And I had to just really just add to, again, what I already have. I already have a set of these. This is when I had just a set of four for the dining area. But now that I have the former dining area that seats 10, but I only normally style, I've been styling so far for eight. And I picked up four more of these beauties, guys. How gorgeous are these placemats? Now, the first set, because I have a total of 12, but the first set was gifted to me by my beautiful sister, Catherine over at um, Amateur Decorate Locker Pro. And so from that, I just built on the look. And so I have picked six, picked up one of the set and then I picked up this set. So now I have a dozen of these beautiful black um, placemats. And they are so versatile. You can use them for a number of things, a number of seasons, um, New Year's, Valentine's, for a gentleman's, for Father's Day look, for Christmas, for I'm gonna use them for fall. I'm gonna do something black for fall, but they're absolutely gorgeous. And I just picked up another set of those and I will have those linked in my description box as well. All right, guys, so that's it, that is all. I am going to now clean up all of this mess because there is stuff everywhere. It's like everywhere I do a haul, baby, these rooms just be looking like the stores that's through. Oh, there's one other thing from Hobby, from um, Amazon, I'm looking at it, on the floor. And honestly, these may be going back. Okay, so let me pull these and I'm going to share them with you. But I think because of the look I'm, I decided on for my dining area, I don't know that I will need these. But then a part of me is like, keep them because they may work for your fall 24 look. Again, I'm already thinking for next year. It is none other than these, you guys. I'll pop a picture on the screen so you can see exactly what they are and what they will look like open up. And it, this is this is actual pompous grass. And I got two sets of them. Hand me the oven because it's a different color in there. And so let me see. Is it a different color? Well, yeah, this one has an, a cream and like a chocolatey, cognac -y type of color inside. And then it has like a solid. Well, both of these are a mixture. And then this set is a solid, like a cognac, chocolatey type of look. But I may or may not send these back because now that I'm thinking about what I'm going to be doing for next year, I don't know. But I don't think I'll be using them for this year for sure, but they're absolutely beautiful. I had some last year, so I know that they're really, really nice and they, they held up well, but I, y'all, I just can't, I can't find them. I don't know where they are. So I went ahead and picked up some more. I think they're like um, $15 per set, so I got a couple of sets of those. And then the final thing you guys I wanna share with you is something that I got from one of you. Hand these over to me. You guys know that I have this whole cognac, um, Tennessee whiskey look that I've been doing the last couple of years, and I have been on the hunt for another throw. So this is my throw, right? It's my infamous, and give me that one up. This is the infamous Tennessee whiskey throw that started this whole look and feel for my um fall styling right so one of you all my good sister tanji she reached out and she said sis i think i may have a match for your throw and so once i saw it and on the picture i was like oh yeah it's perfect and so she brought it over to me because she is a local royal family member now a hair client as well so um she brought this one over and it is it made exactly like it, but it's not the exact color, but it's still gonna work. It's in the, this is more of a whiskey and this is more of a burnt orange or a coppery, but you guys know that it's still gonna work. It's still gonna lay be or look beautifully, beautiful style in the space, but it's absolutely gorgeous and immaculate condition. So thank you, Tanji, for this beautiful throw to add to the collection. So I just love you guys so, so much. So thank you all for all of your continued love, your continued support your comments, your like, your shares. If I haven't come, um, subscribe, uh, if I haven't replied to a comment, know that I'm gonna get around to it. I set up many late nights answering, um, replying to even older videos because I don't want you all to ever think that I'm taking your um, interaction for granted because I'm not. Your girl just be blessed and busy. And I mean, when I lay this head down, I lay this head down and I don't think about comedy, but sometimes if I have a little bit of time in the evening, just winding down in bed, I'll kind of try to sit and reply to some comments, even if I don't do nothing but like and hearty let you know that I saw it, I read it, and I appreciate it. Also, another one of you all for Royal Family Members, and she has her own YouTube channel, and that is my sister, um, D. No, Debbie. I'm thinking about Deidre, but Debbie. 
Debbie Bubbles. Debbie has her own YouTube channel. She is such a sweetheart. She reached out to me um, just today with some items that I just I just love you guys so much. She's um, going to send me some things that's going to tie in with with the um, the whole whimsical fall look and feel for the outdoor. And I cannot wait for those to come in. And of course, I will share them and highlight her and I'll link her channel and all the things in my description box. But you guys are just absolutely amazing. I thank God for you daily because Royalty Designs YouTube would not be what it is without you. So with that being said, until the next video, I want you all to stay safe, remain royal, and have yourselves a blessed and beautiful day. Happy fall, y'all. Get these nails.